mean be a step parent? That's a great question. Uh, a step parent is someone who's choosing to step up and take on a responsibility that legally and biologically they really don't have to, but they're willing to. And once you step up, all the responsibilities come along as though they were your biological child. There's a lot of emotions on what it means to be a step parent, you know. And the best thing is it's very exciting. It, it, it truly is, you know, especially being first time step parent, you know, first time into that situation. There's a lot of things, but it, it is exciting. That's right. my my best emotion for it. Step parent is an additional parent. So you're not replacing the biological parents, but you are to be an asset. Your first job you know, as a stepdad, you want to get to know the dad. And you guys need to have a mutual respect for each other and that you're on the same page in raising said child. You don't trump step, you don't trump the biological father unless he's not in the picture, but you do want to be able to work as a team and not to create different frameworks for a child and they be confused when they go from house to house. I'd say top three, it's, it's tough because I, I guess I I expected a roller coaster of things to be coming my way. How fast I had to grow as a person is, is number one. Um, a lot more responsibility and a lot more happiness for me, for me, for what I've been through, that for sure. Awesome. One, probably just knowing the role of discipline um, the reality is, as a step parent, you have now you have all the legal responsibilities for that child, so yep. discipline shouldn't be equal. But uh, there's this sense that the step parent can't discipline like the biological parent can, or they feel like they don't want to be the bad guy or the bad girl, so they don't. So learning how to properly discipline my child was probably one of the first things that caught me off guard. Second is probably just knowing uh, how much affection or intimacy to show to my child. You know, I'm a stepfather of a young girl. She was seven at the time, so do I hug her? Do I kiss her? You know, no questions asked with my biological daughter, but my stepdaughter is like, do I treat her the same? So just knowing what level of affection mm -hmm. uh, is probably something that caught me off guard because you thought it would just be you walk right into it and it wasn't the case. And um, I think third would be just balancing the, how do I say it? In a marriage, sometimes the spouse takes the side of the child over you because that is their biological child that they've been with since birth, and you are the person that came into the picture. So learning how to balance out that dynamic would be the third thing. The respect that I got from the biological father, I thought one or two was going to be a problem. Being naive in that situation, never doing it. So I thought that was going to be an issue. It wasn't. The love of my stepson, didn't know what to expect, didn't know if he would accept me as his father, stepfather, didn't know if he would listen to me or didn't know he would be able to take my guidance and, and use it. Thirdly, the dynamic between me, my wife, and his dad and his other stepmom became, that's a unique situation when you have four parents trying to raise one child. So you have four, four different attitudes, four different thoughts, and four different opinions but us four work together and actually made it an easier transition than I expected to be. Yeah, so if I was gonna expand on what does it mean to be a step parent, really it means you are choosing to fill a role of somebody who's either not there or somebody that's not in that role full time. I mean, oftentimes there are step parents where there is an active parent, a uh, biological parent, sometimes there isn't. But as a step parent, you are agreeing to be that father, be that mother, be that disciplinarian, provide physically, provide emotionally, do all the things that come along with being a parent. You just happen to be in a role that's defined by law as a step parent. Being a step parent is a critical role in a child's life because you tend to have more time with the child than the biological parents because you end up taking a lot of responsibility because you want that responsibility. So you immerse yourself in that child's life because you want to get to know them because you already come in at a slight disadvantage not knowing them from an early age. Like when I came in my stepson's life, he was already five. So I was dealing with that, trying to get to know him, me being a black man, him being a Latino child. We had that barrier, so we kind of had to make our own relationship. And then further, it becomes an issue and discipline too as well down the road. If you have discipline your stepchild, 
what's the limit, what's the range, can you do this, can you do that? So you have to have that conversation with biological parents and tell them, this is my, how I see it. I'm not here to overstep, but I do want to be involved in the disciplinary action. So I too have the respect of his biological parents and y'all respect me and that we all are trying to rear this child into the way it needs to go. You know, yeah, his, his real dad is in his life, you know, so, and, and much respect to him, you know, because, you know, his dad, his real dad moved out of town. He's in another, he's in Southern California and he's always made an effort to be a part of Aiden's life, you know, but it, it, he sees him, you know, once a month. And so I took on the role of being his everyday role model. And I, and I don't try to separate, I, I do try to separate myself as far as, hey, I'm, I'm Pops. That's, my, that's what Aiden calls me. He does still have his dad. And I have never tried to influence him to change that. You know, I always wanted to make sure that, hey, you know what, your dad is your dad. And, and, and I respect him for that because he does make an effort to be in his life. And my perception on everything was the fact that, hey, it's not about my way or the highway or anything like that. I felt like it was best for me to come in and be another factor to love him and to give him the best examples in life and be the best role model that I can. He can come to me and I try to have that relationship with 